give me this power. Give that Igni sign a little boost. I'll we'll take a save right here. Yeah, I mean, I love. I actually kind of want to replay them just to like refresh my. Oh, there's a werewolf just vibing down there. I think I found a secret entrance. I'm not even gonna F with that werewolf. Before they took away. a right and away from true turn base. Yeah, I sometimes miss turn base stuff a little bit. Jesus Christ. The fuck? Where am I? This is cool. Wait, you I'm have a. Uh, scared. You don't have the potion that you can make you see in the dark, right? Nope. Uh, it's fine. I'm just gonna go off of the map. We're we're gonna we're gonna make it. Okay, see? We're Origins fine. is the best. You did not care for two. Fingers crossed for the new one. Yeah, we do have a torch. We do have a torch, yeah. Um Let's see if I even have it. Um so I'm a really big fan of Fallen London and Sunless Sea, and the guy who created that turns out that he's a creepy sexual abuser and was work he was the lead writer for the New Dragon Age and he got like removed mm, from it obviously. Yeah. Part of the reason it's probably taking so long. I mean I know it's been delayed for so long, but I was like so looking forward to the next Dragon Age because it's supposed to take place in Tevinter, which is like the mage uh country, like the country that's like run by mages, you know? Yeah. Well, I mean, like, what, it's like when I was replaying the new 7, you are gonna be able to, like, talk about it that way, you know? Yeah, it's about, it's supposed to be, um, where, like, uh, Dorian, I think his name is from? Uh, from the last Dragon Age. I think it's speaking to us telepathically. Is this one of the witches? What the heck? Yeah, I loved him. Like he's he's my fave. But yeah, I gotta I gotta replay them. Encourage my ghost. I like are we supposed to be hearing a voice right now or is this like we're just reading the Never heard of a druid circle in Bevan. Like is they're not saying anything, we're just reading yeah. the subtitles here. Okay. The voiceover is missing. What the fuck? The sound is like all weird this whole time, you know? You could try restarting the PS5. Yeah, but like I'm in the middle of a cutscene. Well, so I mean, like, save right this. now, yeah. I want to hear what this sounds like, though. I bet it sounds cool. It's kind of creepy that there's like no sound, though. Yeah. A broth of human flesh. Why did they kill you? It's really weird that that voiceover is missing, but Geralt's isn't. Right? Like, he's still talking, but it's like, nobody is, uh, talking to him. Okay, you claim I can free you? I to be imprisoned. How so? And I really just read along. Read along. I'm bound here in fetters of magic. I wander endlessly, a labyrinth of leaves. The children, I know all. I know what okay, awaits them. So people said when they restart myself. the game, it fixes it. This is commonly happens on this oh, one. Oh, okay. It happens on the few other ones too. If threatens the orphans. I'll help them myself. Children have been taken. Free me, please. Children have been taken. It can be a gal, a gallop unchained. I shall save them. Only I can. It's not not as dramatic as probably if it was the actual voiceover. Um why do you think the kids from the meadow are in danger? <laughs> well, they didn't take that. They were just they were just we were just there, right? Unless they already took Ard Serbin? They took him to a different plane of existence. Where those where it's probably where they are in that picture. Mm. So do we trust this weird spiky heart tree? 
Or do we trust the the kids are not are safe from the crones? What do we think? I don't believe I wish I could hear the tone of voice. Yeah. So that I could I don't know why, but what do you the way it's just so casually spelled. I think I, I thought I already asked this. And you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Serves them. Okay. So do we want this tree's help? Do we want to help this tree? or do we want I mean, help? I think the tree is cooler, but it's your choice. So this tree is claiming it's a druid, like a druid from a circle of druids that the crones killed so they could rule this area of the woods alone. Yeah. But when we walked in, he was like, I've never heard of a druid circle here before. Yeah. So like, the tree could be lying. It could be like an ancient evil. Honestly, it looks evil to me, right? I'm gonna say I don't believe you. I'm gonna take a big risk, because I can't hear what this thing's voice sounds like. His voice say, is really like, hey, like. <laughs> I'm gonna say I don't, I don't believe you. We'll I don't see. Believe you, spirit. Too many claim you're evil. You're this seems evil. sus. Okay, all the powers Are of you nature. saying demon tree lies? I think the demon tree is lying. Okay, you can send all the powers of nature after me if you want, but I'm just gonna be a real Jew. I'm gonna kill them all, so... Alright, round one. Round one is, uh, just some, some bugs. Okay, do I, like... I must live! Okay. All right, round two, round two, some more bugs, some more bugs. Get the heart. Get, get him in the weak spot, in the heart, in the heart. Hit him where it hurts, being single on Valentine's Day. <laughs> I bet you don't even have a date. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Get the tree heart, get the tree, I got him. No! No! That wasn't even that hard. We are over leveled for this, because we, we did the all the side- We got the for that part. We did all the side quests, so. Aw, gasps, dies. Aw, we killed the demon tree. I hope uh, nobody was really, like, rooting for the demon tree. But I feel like diamond dust. Freak was the street. Had to bring V-Day into it. <laughs> How dare you. Everyone is always overleveled. I mean, it's hard not to do the side stuff. You're just oh like... Oh my god. Stop, stop flipping around. I just want you to pick the mushrooms. He's like flipping all the- all right, is there like a treasure chest in the- Huh? Huh? Yeah, you hear that little- Yep. Whoop, whoop. Well, now we can go straight through this path. Oh, you found the tree's voice. Oh, okay, yeah, I want to see what this, it sounds like. But then I'm gonna mute it because we're gonna have to watch it after. Hold on, I will re- I will, um, go out here. And then I'm gonna save, and then we're gonna restart the PS5 to try and get the sound uh, working correctly. So some again. kind of normalcy. Okay. Um. Do I have to? I have to quit, right? It. It just said they they reloaded the game. The game or the PlayStation? The game. Okay. So. So if you just hit the button and oh, here, go ahead. You can do that with you. Just close the game real quick, then you just do a like... Alright, let's go back in. Reopen it. The sound. Yeah, I want to hear what that tree sounds like. Real quick. Who are you? I abandoned my circle. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's like whispery. I abandoned my circle. Sounds evil. Sounds evil, honestly. I speak like Voldemort. I would not I would not wanna trust that tree. You know, Harry trust Potter. The tree. It does kinda sound like Voldemort, the yeah. That kinda hurts. Do. <laughs> the raspy voice, yeah. I'm no Ralph Fiennes. I'm not nearly as fine as Ralph Fiennes. Kira Metz. So I can't skip this part. So. About a mass maid. Siri had seemed to take him shelter in his hideout. I'm uh, surprised that we're still getting the same. That's an excellent Voldy voice, yeah. Me? Yeah. For him. Yet the no, you. Hunt had. The ghostly retinue was oh, I wish I could remember some of his lines. 
The witch is Harry Potter. Like, okay, <laughs> you know he says Harry Potter a yeah. lot. Yeah. So like, the boy who lived. I need like more <laughs> more phlegm in my throat to comfortably do it. I'm trying. I'm trying to think of some other things that he said. All right, we killed the demon tree, everybody. Congratulations. I will now tell the elder man. Oh, you guys all came out here? You killed this werewolf? I didn't kill him. Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. Best Voldemort I, I am on that website right now. The exact same one? Yeah. Wow. Um, a spirit possessed the tree. Oh, wait, I do. I have a very, very vivid memory of this because I have the Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone tape cassettes. I used to listen to them every night while I was sleeping. And I always remember when he was like, he was like, there is no God and There is only power. Ghost. No, stupid. Will it be to back? Seek it. No. <laughs> power, Harry. <laughs> and that's why he's like in the back of Quirrell's head, and you're like, how powerful can you be? You're sharing the back you're of You're literally head. in some dude's other dude's body. That's how weak you are, bro. I want a lecture from you. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. How do you feel about Mads playing Grindelwald? Um, I never saw any other Grindelwalds. I never saw any of the Well, no, because they it. recast Johnny yeah. Depp as Matt, like, middle school. I never, I never oh, saw... Oh, yeah, the audiobooks are so good. Uh, this dude just cut his ear off? Yeah, he deserved it. Why? I don't know. But, um... The ladies tell you to do that? Uh, no bruh, payment. he went full Picasso. To the ladies, or what the hell Van Gogh, that? I mean. What the Not hell? Picasso. Uh, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. <laughs> he can do no wrong. Yeah, the Fantastic Beasts, this just seems like a lot. Yeah, such yeah. a mess. And yeah. I like Grindelwald. He's really interesting. He's more interesting than Voldemort. Voldemort's just racist. Gods nor masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. He who wants to survive must seek his own protectors. The... The ladies ask for a heavy toll, but they do protect the land, is what I'm hearing. Grindelwald is way more interesting. I, I never saw- I mean, I, I saw the first Fantastic Beast movie, and I really liked it a lot. But then, like, you're saying, like, there was, like, all the controversy, all the drama surrounding yeah. the second one. I think I just, like, well, it avoided even... it. I, like, it wasn't even like I intentionally avoided it. I just was like, eh, like, I don't gotta go see it. The kinda, second and then... movie is not as strong, but it's more interesting. The plot is, like, more risky. Okay, ladies. Hey, ladies. Oh, the sound. Okay, ladies, get in line one at a time. <laughs> we're in the tapestry. Well, bring it here. What, what do you, what do you, oh god, what's gonna happen? New and Tina and Fantastic. No, see, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm all in for Magical World War II. I, I would also be in the same boat as where I was watching it for the characters, not for the... I have an obsession with World War One and World War II. Actually, in the memoir I'm reading oh, right add now, another, add another ear to the necklace. I just learned that the one battle that the Schindler children fought in in World War One is uh, the battle that Farewell to Arms is based off. Mm. Never seek to cross us again. She's got literally a bag with an arm sticking out of it. This is a Dark Souls character. <laughs> <laughs> this is the middle one. She's got ropes trying to contain her titties. This is this is out of control. What is happening right now? But now we must talk to our white haired friend. Hush. She's got like a bee's nest in her eye. Oh jeez. These are these, these are the most interesting villains so far that I've encountered. I mean I haven't been doing a lot of the main quest. She is <laughs> Isn't she lovely? Isn't she beautiful? We helped her. She agreed to serve. Oh, just like me. She bears the mark. She is ours. Okay, well, these ladies, ladies do haunt. <laughs> they are haunting. They are very, they're very well-designed hags. Like I hate when people try to make hags, like 
kind of attractive or like, you know, it's like they should be horrific. You know what I mean? Stop trying to make hags fetch. Why do you look different now? I feel like that's a touchy subject, right? We don't want to. Yeah, you time is cruel to, to everyone, Geralt. We know that they used me. Is it what? Have you, either of these worthwhile to be said? But like last time I went right well, into the conversation. I, what I worry about is they're going to tell the bloody Baron about this, right? He's gonna, like, go fucking get her. Go get who? His wife. Um... Wasn't that his wife they were talking about? I thought we were talking about Siri. Well, we're looking for Siri. Never mind. Keep going. I don't know which one to pick. All of them. I would ask him why they look different now. You look different in the tapestry. You look different from your profile pic. Did you catfish me? If you only knew how much time we spent in front of the glass. Let me tell you, ladies, I can tell. I can tell how much work you put into this outfit. This is a lot. Like, those ropes? That would not be... Uh, that would be a lot. Is that consuming. polymorphism? Uh, do you desire us? <laughs> Hell yeah, I do. Do I make you horny, baby? Um, uh, let's just uh, like keep going on. Polymorphism, a rare talent. Let's... Let's, uh, let's, uh, butter them up. Say yes. <sighs> to be woven together with you? Woven together. I I her, her, her twitch in her head is unsettling. Last. Oh, that, uh... Not what I came for. I mean, I did say I was gonna roleplay this as horny... Carol, <laughs> where I just fucked everybody that gave me the option to. I feel like it would be discriminating of me to say no to these three beautiful ladies that are they're coming on to me right now. To tame the whispering hillock. A lot of work. <laughs> I mean, if they're offering, that's all I'm saying. Did you destroy the evil powers? Have you brought peace to our domain? Is it really evil? I, I'm, yes. I'm scared now. So fortunate to have found so brave a knight, so able. Okay. Um. Oh God, I want to know the answers to both of these questions. I think we know what they want the kids for, right? They're gonna eat them. Yeah, they're hungry. Probably. They got a hankering for they're the. They're probably gonna eat them. A hankering for the spankering. The one who once cheated death. A lich. But she couldn't deceive you, brave knight. You've rid the world of a great evil. Did I? Okay, I guess we're on to tell me about the woman I seek. Yeah, tell me about Siri. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given, we never break. That's right. The girl. Mousy blonde. That's what they call it. Mousy blonde? Uh, no, she's, she's got, got like ash in her hair. Exhausted. She could barely stun the poor thing. They're describing me after working this week. I mean, oh, she made a deal with them. We could. Like she was our own daughter. I don't know, little guys. Affection. She proved a very naughty girl. A very naughty girl. <laughs> she was <laughs> stubborn and selfish. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't believe you. I did not raise Siri like that. I taught her to be respectable to her elders. Should I say that? You know? I, I, don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's just say where is she now? I don't know. I, I'm so scared. I'm, I'm choosing something to. They say you always keep your word. So she said, "Don't believe." He said, "Don't believe you anyway." We shall tell you, brave boy. Oh, okay. Okay, flashback time. She just teleported there? Uh oh. She's so powerful. Oh. Taken in your big meaty arms. She's carrying her like I carry Gizmo. Yeah. 
Just come with me, little one. I honestly don't know which hag I think is the creepiest, which is... I think Eyeball Hag is the creepiest. Huh. Are you gonna say me? What? You said which hag? You know. I said I think Eyeball Hag is the creepiest. Oh, I thought you said you know which I hag think, I think I is think the creepiest? I think Rope Hag is the most grotesque. Uh-huh. Because, like, that just seems uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah. So she's got some, like, pain kink going on. Yeah. We cannot. You know she is meant for him. She's meant for him? I mean, yeah, the series segments are really cool. You think the the wild, the leader of the wild hunt will notice if she's missing her legs? It's like that part from Lord of the Rings. Yeah. It's like, they don't need their legs, do they? Very well. Get on with it. I like the idea that these hags are just like straight up telling us this story about Siri. Like they're just saying they're gonna eat her. You regret that girl. Regret it dearly. Hi. Hi, Luna. Oh, there he is. Oh shit. I will not be coming back. I will be escaping. I will, I, will just, the bog. I will just be running through here, I think. I don't I don't I don't foresee me stopping to fight all of you guys. Like that seems Luna? like a bad idea. Have you come to say hi to chat? We're just gonna we're nearby. I've escaped. I guess I could have fought all those things, but Run! He's gonna find us. Yole, yole! Hello, la la la! Then we fight. That's the way to find someone. They're hiding and you go, Shakira, Shakira! And they go, Oh, baby, will you talk <laughs> like that? They can't help themselves. Oh. <sighs> I wonder what would have happened if we didn't kill that tree. I'm gonna look it up later. Because honestly, right now it seems like you have to choose which evil you want to deal with the hags or that tree. I butcher her like an animal and eat her. You still tried to eat her. It's not really a great defense. I don't know if you know that. But you know that. Such a shame she fled. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah, I'll have to yeah, open it in the background so we can check it out. Um, okay, I won't let you get away with it, so I could fight them right now. Or I'll find her and come back for you. Your choice. Because if I... I feel like I'm going to say I'll find her and come back for you. Because I don't want to fight them right now. And also, I'm worried if I, if I fight them, then they'll stop protecting the town in their weird way that they protect the town, you know? Ooh, which one would you pick? I mean, I would try and fight them, but that's because I want to see what they do in a fight. But all right, let's let's fight them. You tried to kill her. Can't forgive you for that. Waste of words. Is it? Our fates are bound to. But now is not the time for that to be. Oh, maybe we're not gonna fight them. Now you shall chase shadows and wander midst fog. Okay. Each time you see her, she will I want to know what each of them looks like under those masks that they have on. And if you find her, if you go, you will die. Um, I do not like what you're doing with those legs. I do not like that at all. What the heck was that? Oh. All right, bye ladies, thanks for the chat. Tell the Baron what you've learned about Anna. What did I learn about Anna? I'm pretty sure the lady serving her them is Anna. Oh, that old That's lady? That's what I was saying earlier. Oh, the grandma is Anna. That's what you're saying. 
Like this lady. Maybe she's not in here anymore. Violence is never the answer, it's the question. And the answer is always yes. <laughs> it's a very Hitchhiker's uh... Guide to the Galaxy kind of quote. Yeah? A hitchhiker's oh, I Luna up. for the kitty. I, I gotta level up! Let's, uh... This is the Igni one. What is was this one? I already got that. I can't- so I need more... I need one more to unlock that? Okay, let's- let's- Wait, wait, wait. Go back down. Down. In branch one. So is that the first row? I mean, the first row is already fully unlocked. I think it means this, just this level. HK47 from Go- Oh yeah, it is! I'm excited for the remaster of that. Uh... And the remaster of how cute Luna is in my lap right now. Let's do- let's do the exploding shield one. This seems like- that seems like a good ability and the next time we can get the- Excuse me. Don't be scared, Luna. Your mom is just sneezing the demons out of her body. I got the sniffles. Okay, so I want to go here, I think. And then that way I can fast travel to... Can you hit over on the bed? There's one other place of power. Not here, but somewhere in this area, I think is what it said. Um... I don't know. There it is, you see. I just, I just wanted to see how many there were in this region. Well, remember, this isn't telling us that. It's telling us there's one Oh, and that you two. found. Yeah. Right, 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 right. We learned that. There is a, there is a location that is a question mark pretty close by if I want to go there. And then I could sail to this bandit's camp and then fast travel to the Duke. It's up to you. To the Baron, I mean. I am content because Thank I you. have my cat to stroke. I uh, didn't take my allergy medicine today, so I feel like I'm sneezing because Luna is uh, next to me. I'm allergic to cats and we have two cats, but you know, you gotta love the, you know, the baby. Okay, these guys, work off, you guys. Why are you so strong? Alright. Luna did not like that singing. Oh. Hello? Hello? My ballad brings all out the here? coins to the barn. Hello, all God the coins to the barn, and they're like it's much and better than yours. Is hotter than yours. Monster prowls the the bog. This monster. I could teach you, but I'd have to charge exactly. We do be charging. We charge for our work. Dandelion could make that ass flat. Burning like coals and a jaw full of fangs. You think Dandelion could make that ass flat? Humanoid. Probably. I bet a Dandelion knows how to twerk. First attack. Remember when the lion? Yeah. I bet he do. It was then Boren vanished. Merrick and Tommel went looking for him, didn't come back again. Toss a corn to your witcher, O Valley of Blendy, oh. Back that thing up. Master, it's the best sword. I was trying to approach Blaviken, but they heard me with these cheeks clapping. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Assume you. I can help for a fee. I for me. To know someone reads it, I'm, I'm hot. A dozen eggs hot to here. It up. I can help <laughs> for a fee. Of course. Why, even an ox don't pull a plow for free. That's right. I gotta pay my bills. How much are you willing to pay? I'm afraid I'll need more than an ox needs. How much are you willing to pay exactly? How would you say, how would you feel about two, four, three? 
I was increased by one. We're doing pretty good. We have not watched the new season yet. Yeah, we it's on our list of things to watch, but we have we have a system where we try to go through all the yeah. shows that we want to watch so that we don't miss anything, but unfortunately it makes us behind yeah. when like something new comes out and everybody watches but it. Like ideally you know, like, we would watch that now. But we're very close to finishing BuzzFeed Unsolved. And then we've got season two of Lock and Key. Yeah, I really want to watch Lock and Key. And then I'm Witcher. That. And then the Book of Boba Fett. Oh, he was the Swamp Thing person. I think I just uh, talked to him about the Witcher contract. But you know what? We'll do that later. It's fine. We are watching Unsolved. We're we in... love Unsolved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's so good. We're almost done. We're in season seven. We and we always say like, that it's so funny because the two the two guys for Unsolved are like what Ian and I would be like if we did ghost hunting together. I think. Yeah. Like I would definitely be having panic attacks like Ryan does when he goes into a haunted building. God, there's so many of you Some guys. demons, it's me. Yo boy. Yo boy. I have a button on my jacket that says that. And a lot of times at work when I leave, I go, bye ghosts. I love you. And people are like, what? <laughs> it's me, ya boy. Goat man, I'm dancing on your oh, bridge, oh goat god. man. Can you guys like, oh my god. Can you guys like back up. We got him, we got him, we got him, we got him. Oh, you thought you had me, you thought you had me. This guy's pretty tough. Okay, we got him. Alright. But yeah, we, uh... I'm trying to think of what my favorite episode of Unsolved was has been. I do like the Goatman episode. The Goatman episode is really good. Hey, Goatman, it's me. I'm dancing Turn on your, your bridge, bridge go man. man. <laughs> That's pretty good. Also, the one where they do the, the beauty YouTubers apartment. Yeah, that one was pretty cool because it felt like it was actually saying stuff. Yeah. Like in the spirit box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, um, what was I going to say? Um,. The demon episodes of that show, simultaneously, I think they're hilarious because Ryan freaks out so much, but then also, like, I am very nervous watching them, so I'm like, oh god, what's gonna happen? What if, what if something happens? See, I've had, like, real paranormal experiences, or at least, like, I can't explain them well enough, so I call them real. Uh-huh. And you're like, I don't know, what's the, have you had a paranormal experience? I don't think so. Yeah. But you know... Also, like, oh god, go ahead. I was actually. just saying, like, you're like jumpier than I am, but like, maybe it's because I haven't experienced anything that yeah. jumpier. Just the thought of it, because I don't know what it's actually like, you know. But I was going to say, with the Buzzfeed Unsolved, sometimes we'll be watching it, and like, if we watch it for like, sometimes we'll binge it for like a couple hours. Yeah. And like, depending on what the episodes are, like, I remember when we were had been watching it for a while. <laughs> yeah, I haven't had that experience yet. I Unless you count the cats as demons. Some cause... pretty legit sleep paralysis stuff. The, the cats will come in. So and like, I'm not sleep. saying like all of it is supernatural. I might be like, you know, your brain's just fucked up when you're sleeping. Uh huh. But like, I have had some weird, weird stuff happen. Um, but like sometimes we were watching that, you know, and there was like I remember there was that one episode where like. Apparently I can't jump up onto the dock here. Um, the one family, they had all, like, gotten into the car and, like, drove... You remember that episode? They all, like, drove really far away through Canada or something. And the parents were like, we got like, we gotta get out of here. And the kids yeah, were like, what the fuck? fuck and happening. then the kids, like, were with them, but then the kids left and then... Like, nobody knew why they did that, or, you know, all that kind of stuff. Like, watching that was like, oh my god, what if we did that one day? Driving yeah, driving to, to Canada. Hey, we're from not too far away from Canada. We're basically South Canada. That could have been us. I mean, we live in Atlanta right now, that, but we're from Buffalo. That could have been us in that story, is all I'm saying. Yeah. Hello, Luna. Luna has returned. 
Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, it was it was super weird, but, like, whenever we were watching BuzzFeed Unsolved for a long time, and then, like, stories like that come on, I'm like, I start to feel, like, paranoid, you know? I'm like, no. Yeah. What, what, what's gonna happen? Oh. Hello, Luna. Matt! Just chillin'. We're back with the goat boys. Goat man. I am definitely a Shane, though. Yeah? You think there's a BuzzFeed Unsolved personality quiz? There's gotta be. There's gotta be a BuzzFeed Unsolved personality quiz. I feel like there has to be. Okay. Sir, I found your wife. Uh, the problem is she works for these hags. So, I don't know what you're gonna do about that. It's time to find out if your personality matches either Shane or Ryan. You want to know who's hosting this quiz? Who? Buzzfeed. Oh, okay. That makes sense. That tracks. They do a lot of quizzes there. I'm listening. What do you come to me with? All right. Are you ready for this one, bro? I don't think you're ready for this story. Got news of your wife. Plowing hell. Why did you not say so forthwith? Where is she? Why have you not returned with her? She's in Crookback Bog. Got food, a place to live, and keeps herself busy. Didn't look like she had the slightest desire to leave. You also, she works for a bunch of hags, so... I was supposed to find her, and I did. That was our deal, nothing you were out, you, you didn't specify I had to bring her back. You know how you verbal deals work in this world, right? You gotta specify. Bastard, don't you? You believe I alone am a I mean... I do think that you are at fault for what happened here. Um, abusive I know, his abusive drug, drug is angry. I don't really care if you're mad. Because also, I feel like I could probably kill you if I, I got Ryan. You. you got Ryan? Yeah. Why? Because, like, I, I'm i not like Shane, where <laughs> I'm I say, like... well, yes. I already got his card. I'm like a cold, hard disbeliever, you know? Uh, I think most paranormal things are not paranormal, but I do yeah, think some are. you're not like Shane, because Shane doesn't believe in that stuff at all. But he so. believes in aliens. Yeah. That's, that's exactly what I think. The world might seem black and white to you witches, but for us common folk, it's um, shades of gray. I, listen, every time I learn something more about the story of what happened, it seems more like it's your fault. So... Do you want to get his side of the story? I, w I want to know. Tell me what- Probably you tell me your side, yeah. although I've already heard from your daughter, so... I'm willing to hear your side of the story. Well, I'll tell you what. My wife was mean to me, so she deserved to be she pushed down the stairs. She made me launder my own undergarments. That's how it is. With Annie, it was love at first sight. A spear tore through my shoulder at the Battle of Anchor. She tended to my wound. Once I'd recovered... Why well, don't you ever tend to my wound? Ah, uh, the classic nurse and, and soldier falling Soon in after. love story. This is the plot of Farewell to Arms by Hemingway. And after that, they sent me to Sidaris. A warlord had risen against King Athen, and Faltest sent out. Athen. It was one battle to the next, one conflict after another. It was a life of war. I was seldom home, and I found comfort in drink. Grew so fond of hooch, I couldn't part with it. And I so far, I'm not hearing anything to clear your name, but go on. So it's your fault <laughs> after all. <laughs> oh, I do kind of want to say that, but let's see. And then what happened? It sounds but, still kind of sounds like it's your fault, from but... Front to front, battle to battle, collecting soldiers' coin. I mean, with this baby. still sounds like... Lighter, Are you probably? learned she'd not been so alone after all. For nearly three years, Ooh, she found comfort in the An affair. Heaven, a childhood friend. A, a dog's, dog's bunghole? Understand, Excuse me? You're telling me you were <laughs> cast the whole time you were at war? I put it out of her mind. But the woman cuckolded me for years. Without a whisker of concern for me, for my love. So you push her down a place. I still don't I see. This man is a pack. I mean, that sucks. Came home one day and Anna was gone. The things too. Found a letter. 
She wrote that she didn't love me. That she'd left me for that knob licker and taken Tamara with her. <laughs> knob licker? Felt like I'd been rammed in the ass by a horse. I went to find the bugger to get the girls back, bring them home. Oh no. As soon as I saw him. Damn. Something turned inside me. Oh Something no. Dark. I slaughtered the shit eating twat and fed his carcass to the Dude, dog. you gotta go to therapy for your anger issues. It seems like they call you bloody for a reason. I don't, I mean, I still kind of think it's mostly your fault. But what did Anna say? I imagine Anna wasn't exactly pleased. Ha! Bloody understatement if I've ever heard one. Huh? She said, said huh? <laughs> threw herself at me, kicking and clawing. Finally oh, grabbed a knife. It would have been the end of me if I'd not leapt aside. It was the first time I hit her. I had to calm her. I had to hit her after I killed her love. Things this is one of your favorite arcs of the game. They would never be the same. Anna tried to take her own life and mine Damn. several times. She would prod me. How come the auto romance isn't this passionate? I'm glad it's not. She'd scream that I'd robbed her a life of love, that I'd destroyed the idea for her. I mean, you kind of killed her boyfriend. I mean, you were married to her at the time. I get it. It's very sad. But it seems like you did not react in a good way. She cared not a bit. Two years of her anger had turned to indifference. Broken at times were bouts of hysteria or my bouts of drunkenness. You guys were sleeping together during this time? Because she got pregnant somehow. Now, as you know now, not everything was as it might have seemed. I mean, it seemed like everybody knew what was happening. Yeah. Seemed you deserve each other? Can't say I care all that much about this. All right. I feel like I want to pick this one. You can pick I it. I feel like I want to pick this one. I don't know. He might he might kick me out. But you know what? I don't know, man. You just seem like an angry drunk man. So... Got only yourself to blame, I think. Leaving her to fend for herself. How was I not to? I was a soldier. I had no choice. Well, I meant the more of like killing choice. killing him after. Ah, sod it all. I see all my prattlings for naught. You won't bring Anna home, I know that. Will you betray to me how she landed in that bloody swamp? Well... I feel like I don't want to tell him she made a pact with the crones. Hot. <laughs> Wait, I had to find the tweet- the chat that you were referencing yeah, I was like, when I was saying that. I'm gonna say she's with the crones. I have a crone story. I saw a crone. Your wife is you with saw a crone? Yeah, in Wales. What the fuck Was this mean? near the hot dog man? No, this is on the other side of the country. I want to make a pact with the crones. Are they going to give me cool powers? I'm actually wearing a Baba Yaga shirt. So <laughs> I'm making a pact with the crones. Why do you think I have so many cats? They're my familiars. Call the crones. Chicken hut where she makes her home. Uh, did a fiend Baba capture Yaga's her? I can't remember how she got there. I wasn't listening. Town. Same girl! Exactly. We already got all. Made like I said the other day, all women are magical, well, alright? We are all magical. A pact. <laughs> the I was hanging out with a whale. Or a crone inside a whale. A child she didn't want to bear. It was like Pinocchio. For help. No, I was studying King Arthur in the Mabinogian in Lampeter, Wales, just outside Aberystwyth. And they kept their word in their own twisted way. What do you mean? Anna must have thought the child inside her would somehow disappear. Instead, the crone sapped her of strength and ultimately forced her body to miscarry. That's messed up, man. I think that's when she started to lose her mind. Then they placed magic tethers that's on That's messed her. up. Tethers that cause great pain when tested. Having a black cat just hits different. That's true. We don't have a yeah, black cat. Well, my black cat's back in Buffalo. Like, Luna is black and white. And Gizmo, and Gizmo a is a tortie, so they have, like, both have patterns Boy, on their kitties. skin. Their fur, not their skin. Well, I guess their skin would have patterns too. I don't know. Um, we must get her out. I would not recommend venturing into the swamp. I just want to say that much. Yeah, their skin. Okay, yeah. I, I was like, I think that their skin is also patterned. 
like the fur. Venturing into the swamp, even with armed men, is just a bad idea. It's a dangerous place inherently, and I think those crones are a greater threat than anyone realizes. I mean, she's only got to work for them for a year, right? To return her. Would you wait? Count on their mercy if they had your daughter. Probably. Uh... But I'm a witcher. And I'm a husband and a father who's fucked off his How's life. How's this song go? I'm a lover. lover. I'm a father. Oh, like, what's this then. song? Go there I don't know. And what are you trying to sing? I don't know. Uh... I love calicos and thornies. They're so cute. Yeah, calicos are really cute. So Gizmo, I, I wish Gizmo I've was over here so we could show you, but she has like the like yeah. part orange Phantom part. Of the opera face. Yeah, they kill the only female. Yeah. I definitely yeah. I knew that fact. Yeah, because my dad had a calico cat yeah. growing up. So we were looking it up because I was like, trying to find the male cat because I thought Luna would get along better with the male than the female cat. I don't know if that's true because she lived with my sister's cat Odin for many years. I thought we breathed our last. The fuck? Oh, the story. If I don't survive this, you're to take whatever you want from the fortress. Uh, excuse me? Let's show this bastard what we're worth. Oh, oh, jeez, oh. please. What the frick? Okay, hold on. A basilisk? I'm poisoned. Okay, I, I don't have any signs. Okay. We got this, we got this. Do you this. think there are like calico monsters? Like there are calico cats? Uh, probably? Imagine the calico basilisk. Can you come over here, please? Ah, what the fuck? This wolf just came out of nowhere. Okay, you got me, you got me. That's fair, that's fair. It breathed this poison breath on me. Come back, come back. Oh, there you are. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! I don't have any healing potions, it's fine, it's fine. Okay. I feel like the Siri fights are not as hard because you don't have time to, like, prepare stuff, usually. Yeah. I mean, maybe that will change in the future, but... Oh, man! Oh, no! There he goes! Might have been good if he actually got carried away. Uh, get to the top of the tower, sir. Sir, can I have him back, please? Damn it! I can't leave him like that. Why not? Um. Okay. Can you teleport through there? Uh, maybe. I didn't even think of that. Nope. No. Okay. Go left. Look left. at the wall ends. Oh, there's a rock outcropping. Damn left. Oh, I was looking wait, at wait. this, you see. Yeah. Okay, clearly this is not... I'm sorry. Oh! Horse! This, this is not where I'm supposed to be. Okay, what, maybe maybe here? Climb climb this? Climb climb this? This is not where you're okay. supposed to be. I don't know where I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to go to the tower. Well, I mean, how? I think you've got to go backwards. You gotta get on your horse. I have to get on my horse? Where'd he go? Oh, look at the map. Where am I? What am I? Sad to be named after a robot? Siri. Oh. <laughs> no, she's older than Siri, right? Is her full name? Cirilla. Okay, Cirilla, yeah. Comic Sans. <laughs> Oh, come on, come on, we almost made it. Nope, all right. All right, we're, we're supposed to do something specific. I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. Loot. Have a loot in two in Christmas. Um, I wish that there was some kind of direction. It said get to the top of the tower. Well, I mean, this keeps blinking. There's one random wolf that came up, so I'll pick that up. This wolf has a smoke bomb. I don't think I'm supposed to go backwards, but I don't left. know. I, I tried that already. Oh, There's okay. like another thing blocking the path. 
Oh, no. maybe you gotta go backwards. It's not letting me jump over. What the heck? Back. All right. Well. Well. Goodbye, Baron. It was nice knowing you. Yeah, I don't know. This is the only way I can go. This seems not right, but maybe, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's a big circle. Hold on. You seem not right. I don't, at least I can go this way? Can I go up this path? Jump up and get as close as you can to the tower. You don't actually have to climb it. Well, there's a lot of enemies over there. Okay. Jump. Okay, I was trying to do that. It didn't seem to be working, but I'll try to just parkour over the stone and hope for the best. Yeah, because I ran pretty far away when I was going the other direction, so that seems... Steam forms say it's finicky. Okay. So let's just try... Just go like this. Oh, maybe like in this little yeah, in hole. The window. No. The window. Pa parkour. 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 <sighs> yeah, I feel like <sighs> girl. I feel like girl. Can you just climb, please? She's sliding all over the place. Oh. Okay. It's saved. The music is very intense, but nothing is happening. <sighs> Hello? Luna, solve the puzzle for us. Let me in! Let me in! Help. I feel like I should be able to go through that... that... thingy. Maybe I have to restart the game? I don't know. Grab on! You can definitely climb that! There's like little handholds and everything. Okay. <sighs> And maybe I have to restart the game? I don't know. I don't- it was letting me go this way. I could try run it all the way back, but I feel like I'm not no. encountering anything, you know? I feel like I should be encountering something. Witcher 3, get to the top of the tower. Do- well, in the meantime, we'll just listen to the wonderful background music. There's a lot of enemies over here, but I can't even get this way. YouTube! The rescue? You need to go directly right from where the cutscene ended. Directly right? Like, from where you were standing when the cutscene ended. I am also watching that same video you sent. Alright, well, I gotta run all the way back. I thought maybe it would let me loop around. I don't remember where, which way I was facing when the cutscene ended. You were ended. facing pretty much towards that first one you ran towards. I was facing towards the tower. Yeah, the the cart that blocks the path. Okay. So, let's say the cutscene ended and I'm facing this way. Mm -hmm. So I have to go to the right. So I'd go directly right. Hold on, we get- Oh! He made a sound! Okay, there we go! What the heck? Why- why is this a thing? Why? YouTube has saved us. The sound is all messed up, for me at least. It's like- I know, I like, without YouTube I would just be running around for hours trying to figure that out. Yo, that was pretty sick. Finish him off. She's doing it all in heels, everybody. Beheaded. He's actually a dubstep villain. Siri seems like she'd be really good at those bull riding uh, games. She does. Where it's like, you gotta try and balance. Have you ever seen the girls that can like stand on top of it? Yeah. It's pretty crazy. I bet you could do Have it. Have I seen the girls? Have you seen the girls? 
period. That's all I see in this oh, yeah? apartment is the girls. That's true. You live with uh, all, only girls. Yep. You just reminded me of the guy who came into work today. I was only the only man in the store. Uh-huh. And he, like, walked... He came over and bought some coffee, walked around the store once, and he was like, are you the only guy working? And I was like, yeah. He was like, my man. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> and you were like, don't be weird, dude. <laughs> right. You have everything? I mean, to be fair, I don't think he's hit on Siri yet. And she's pretty hot. I shall never forget it. It's why I must go? What does that mean? I think it means, like, she has power and it's gonna summon big, scary, spooky uh, things. Okay. To, I'll uh, say that one, I think. To probe him. Yeah. I certainly hope not. It's brought me no small trouble. Meaning? I must flee. Wraiths pursue me. The wild hunt. I was foolish to use the power. They're sure oh. to have caught my sense. Oops, every time I was teleporting around. Pursuing you. I'll endanger all of you by remaining here. You must tell the people to bar their doors and windows. And no one is to wander the night. And you? Where do you think you're going? I don't know, around. Right for Novigrad. And then who knows where. I saw somebody saying that Skellige, is that how you pronounce that country? Is where the majority of the side quests are for this game. And that you can get lost there for like an insanely long amount of time. And as I was reading that, I was like, wait, Skellige, that's the majority of- I mean, There's so many in this area. Like, yeah. are you telling me that another area has more? Like, it's crazy. Redanian armies blocked the Pontar crossing. Yet you sent Ciri to Novigrad. She was looking for a sorceress, and all of them are in Novigrad. Besides, I didn't leave her at the Redanians' mercy. I gave her a letter of safe conduct. Uh, where'd you get these letters? Where'd you get these letters? I haven't always led this pack of jesters. Served in the Temerian army once. Redanians guard the crossing. True, but with a bit of fame and a friend here and there, well... Banners and heraldry don't mean so much. Alright, I'm gonna go to Siri's Novigrad. Siri's still in Novigrad. I mean, Novigrad. I was like, here, say it. Nothing. That's what I Geralt mean. Geralt will correct you. you. To know. You must be in a hurry. But 422 hours to 100% the game in DLC? Speed oh my out. god. I, I mean, we're probably not gonna 100% it. Because that would be insane. We'd be playing this for years. You know? heard me. I mean, I might 100% it in my free time, I heard you. but... Which is why I could use your aid. I've no more tales of Siri to offer you, but go with me and I'll be generous with what To I get do. his wife, is that what he wants? Uh-huh. Um, I don't really want to go with him, honestly. I think he's gonna get killed by the hags if I don't go with him, though. That's his problem. Yeah, sorry, bro. I just don't have the time. If I don't go with you. To you, nothing. Now I'll probably lose a few more men in the swamps. I'm determined to make this journey. I'll think about it. Fuck thinking. Just help me. I'll gather my men and ride to Dan Warren. Once you've mulled it up. I was in no rush. There. Yeah, that's a 422 hour one. Yeah, that's a lot of time. What the? What the? Dare you. What the heck is that? Sorry, we was never here. What the heck is that? What was that? Here to he explain came yourself? In, summoned by the scent of my refreshing Lacroix? My men call him Uma and say he's a beast. But he seems a man to me. Just hideous as Ardle's shit. What? Wait, what? Uma. Strange name. Aye, strange. But he gave us no other. You mean he can talk? Hardly. <laughs> he can do like more this. than just go... <laughs> him. He sat there, not saying a thing, trying to stick a towel up his nose. So I grabbed his hand, looked him in the eyes, and asked, What's your name? Gave me this 
damn foolish look and stammered. Oh, Uma? And so maybe that's not his name. Maybe he just was making sounds and uh, you mm. just decided to name him that? Like a monster, but my medallion's trembling. My medallion's Ouch. trembling. My spidey sense. It? Funny story, actually. I wouldn't you want it? Game of cards. Nothing better to play for? Must have been pretty desperate to play for that. Ah, quit your carpy, smart ass. Someone wagered him and we played. <laughs> if anyone would. Yeah, he was up for the odds, so I just decided. <laughs> Funny story. How so? Went to Novigrad once to rest, indulge in the city's pleasures. Stayed at a tavern and some folk they were playing, so I joined in. Cards were kind that day. Had one devilish hand after another. Robbed the Horsons blind. Horsons is like their the favorite curse word of this game. Yeah. They love Gambling saying Horsons. It like reminds me of when I uh, watched... Do you ever watch the old HBO show Spartacus? Nope. They, they used to use this curse all the time in the show and it was Jupiter's okay, cock. That was what they would say is like the curse word because they were like Romans. Yeah. So like they were supposed to, that was supposed to be cursed. I was just like, man, they say that a lot. Well, yeah, because like if you were the son of a whore, you were the son of someone. You couldn't, like even if you were, I had a royal father, you really wouldn't be in line, you know? Mm. Even got a jester. Oh, yeah. Now I feel something's not right with him. How so? Well, he seems well, more beast than man. But there's wisdom, cunning in the bastard's eyes. Sand, snow, water. Ever run into anything like him? Are those no, but he doesn't look the dangerous. bastards from Game of Thrones? Mm. Well, I guess that's that. Or is this something that was happening in the dialogue that I wasn't paying attention to because I was talking about curse well, words? Oh, I was like, oh, look, I got it. The <laughs> bastards from Game of Thrones. So <laughs> Heck well. yeah! I hope you find your daughter. I was like, oh man, there was like a riddle in the dialogue and I missed it. <laughs> and prove a good father to her. I don't know, man. I think you just need to let your daughter and your wife go. You need to let it go. Alright, bye! Have fun getting killed by the ladies! Bye! A long journey. Yeah. You got fast travel, dude? Probably not. Only cool people like witchers have fast travel. Family counselor. I don't want to be a family counselor. Ah! Okay, so we did say we would see if we could do any of the witcher armor quests. We did say that. Okay, let's take a look. Oh, we're done with main quest stuff for now, so we're on we're on to the secondary quest. I think the armor. I was like, I think the armor is under the treasure hunts. Yeah, there you go. We're kind of, we got that one. We could do this one, level eleven. The other one seemed too scary. Right Find now. all the diagrams. They, are they all over the place? We we'll have to see. Let's look at the map. Because not only do you have the levels, don't mean much on these. If you're like prepared correctly, right? Yeah. That's not Ronnie's playstyle. Her playstyle is slap. Slap. Slap on the face. Okay, so we're going there. So maybe we will fast travel to Re Reardon Manor and then go from there. Just gotta remember how to get out of here. Okay, here we go. Remember when I came in here that one time? And everybody kept air. talking to me? And I was like, can I just walk? I'm just trying to go play Gwent. Everyone is just talking by your up. I can't believe we've been streaming for almost three hours already. Yeah. They went by fast. I really liked the ladies of. That was a Bond. very cool that was quest. A, that was a cool quest. You need to read The Ocean at the End of the Lane. I've read it. Oh, okay. So that was, was like, one of the books early on in our relationship, I think. You were like. Or maybe you weren't dating it at that point, but you recommended it to me. I listened to it as an audiobook. Yeah. You, like, shared it with me. Because I think. I thought. I was like, you would like, like, the, the witchiness. 
Yeah, no, that was a good that was a good story. It wasn't like super long or anything either, you know? Mm-hmm.